Welcome back to the Dubai International Boat Show 2023. We are on board the magnificent Majesty Triple One. Let's take a look. We are going to take a tour and I'm joined by Richard Morris from Australian Super Yachts. Richard, this yacht was announced at last year's Dubai Boat Show and now it's finally here on display. What has been the reaction so far? Four signed contracts. Really? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> this is a, a good game changer and uh, we're hopeful of having one in Australia next year. It's an evolution of what we achieved with uh, the 100 and the 122 on Sydney Harbour. Very successful yachts. We believe this will be even more so. Great, let's take a look around. Come on in. So this is Golfcraft's latest luxury build. I mean, it's 34 meters, 240 gross tons, and just looks spectacular inside. And the key feature is that there's six opulent guest suites. So that's 12 passengers, and normally you'd have to purchase a 50 meter to get six suites. So this is a real game changer, and we're very excited about the charter potential in Australia. So tell me about the interior and this vast space. Well, it's a, uh, a new designer. Uh, from Holland, uh, Phantom, and they've brought a very contemporary, modern design, uh, which as you can see, it's, it's, it's striking. The head height, the use of multiple different you know, suedes and fabrics, and I think it's going to appeal to a lot of our clients. I'm well, excited to see what the master suite has in store for us. Well, there's something very special and unique in here. Oh my God. <laughs> That is different. That's a jacuzzi. So what was the inspiration behind this? Well, it started with a skylight, natural light. And then, well, why not put a jacuzzi there? And then when it's empty, it's a clean piece of glass. So from your, from your bed, you can be looking at the stars. And... I have to say, that owner's suite is one of my favorite I've ever seen. So what do you see what we've got down here? So this is the sixth cabin. Normally, you know, when an owner invites his friends, you want to give them a very opulent suite to, to live in, otherwise you might offend them, you know. So here you've got a, the ability to give your, you know, your number one guest a beautiful, spacious suite. And then you've got two other big suites down aft. And in the middle, we've got the twin cabins, which can have a third Pullman bunk. So tell me about some of the, the specs of this yacht and the performance. Well, it's up to 22 knots, MAN engines. It's got a SCR exhaust scrubbing system, which is a new thing. Incorporate is a lot of uh, technology for using waste heat to heat water, which means you're saving fuel, you're burning less CO2, and it all looks good too. I mean, wow. It is very wow. So this is the famous jacuzzi. It is. The top of what we've just seen in yep. the owner suite. Yeah. Surrounded by sun pads galore, a beautiful dining suite, a great vantage point here on the bow. But come and check out that, there's a lounge right up on the bow. Coming out of the bridge deck, you have this sky lounge. This is a big bar, this is, this is party central, huge TV there. So it's your nice lounge to get away from it all, or have 50 of your mates. So you can really open up those doors and have just one big room, one big party. Big, a big party. I can imagine this area would really appeal to the Australian market because you've got, you know, barbecue, bar facilities there, great dining area and lots of space on the aft deck. So Richard, tell me about the beach club on board the Majesty Triple One. It's uh, customizable to what the owner wants. Uh, but you could fit a, a couple of jet skis in there, some flight boards, some diving gear, paddle boards, and then on the swim platform, probably a six meter tender. Great place to come out of the water, have a sh you know, rinse off and, and lounge around. Richard, you've had a lot of interest of this model of yacht already in Australia, haven't yes, you? Yes, yes, we've got two very interested clients. They're particularly interested in the charter potential. This yacht will be profitable if it's operated like the other yachts that are on Sydney Harbour right now. There's nothing like it in Australia, nothing of this size of quality in Australia, and we can't wait to get it there. 
Richard, thank you so much for having me on board. I very much enjoyed our tour. And we'll be back with more from the Dubai International Boat Show very soon.